So the question is, what tea do I not like? What tea do I really hate? And uh, there is one. Um, there are several, there, there actually there are several. But what I want to talk about today is decaffeinated tea. Uh, not only do I hate decaffeinated tea, I hate the concept of decaffeinated tea. I question the need for its very existence. Um, my view is that if you want to drink something without caffeine, drink something without caffeine, such as rooibos, uh, peppermint, any number of drink water, <laughs> drink something that doesn't have caffeine, don't drink something with, with the caffeine artificially removed. I personally like caffeine, um, I find it wakes me up in the morning, I find it keeps me alert, um, I'm lucky of course, I can tolerate it and I know that not all of you can, I know that some of you have been told by your doctors to cut down your caffeine, some of you get the jitters you know, immediately, some of you even have very very strong negative reactions to caffeine. Um, some of you are unable to sleep um, if you have caffeine in, in the afternoon or evening. So I, uh, I have some sympathy. Um, and with that in mind, um, I, have something, um, I have something for you. But first of all, let me explain why I don't like caffeine, uh, decaffeinated tea. It's because uh, it's, there is no process for decaffeination of tea that leaves the flavour intact. There is no such thing as decaffeinating tea without removing at least some of the flavour. It just can't be done. As a result of which, it's not perhaps always the best quality teas which are chosen to go through the decaffeination process. So potentially you can end up with a pale imitation of something that wasn't particularly good in the first place. So that's, that's why I don't like it and I avoid it. However, as I said, I have considerable sympathy for those of you who are not as fortunate as me, so this is what I've done about it. For some years now, we have found um, what I consider to be the best decaffeinated tea I can lay my hands on. And we've been very pleased with it now for some time, and that is the one that we always buy, we don't buy any other. So I believe that we have you know, as good a decaffeinated tea bag as you can find. Um, furthermore, we've now created a range of flavoured decaffeinated teas. So we've used our natural flavouring oils to add to the decaffeinated tea and make what I think is quite a unique range of flavoured decaffeinated teas. So all the, the peach, the coconut, all of them, all of the flavours we do, Earl Grey of course, you can now get in decaffeinated form. So yeah, I hate it. However, I understand your pain. So I've done the absolute best I possibly can for you. And hopefully you, you will like it. So thanks very much.